and welcome to TNT, the economy news show from Tradimo and myself. So starting from Wednesday, the April of 10, a lot of numbers will come out uh, for Australia. The uh, Westpac Consum Consumer Confidence Index uh, fell down to 4.8% month to month to 98.8 in March. This is the lowest number since 2017 and this is described as a recession and a downturn in housing markets. In the United Kingdom, yes, uh, the trade deficit increased to 3.83 billion pounds in January. So the never ending story of the Brexit talks make an uncertainty in the UK's economy. And let's see what will happen by the meeting of May and Merkel, the Chancellor in Germany. Also, the European Union uh, will uh, have the press conference regarding their rates, but the rates will be remain unchanged. That's my opinion. Uh, so no surprises will be expected. Parallel to the uh, ECB press conference, uh, the numbers for the inflation rates will come out in the United States. And uh, this will be also a very big influence in currencies, and uh, especially in US dollar and euro currency. In the evening uh, at 6 p.m., uh, the FOMC meeting uh, will be held in the States. So, but uh, in my opinion, uh, the rates remain also unchanged at uh, current level this year surprises or won't be expected. On Thursday, the April of 11, the inflation rates uh, for China will come up uh, for March. Uh, China's inflation fell to 1.5% in February from 1.7%. This is the lowest inflation rate since one year. Uh, a little bit later in Germany, the inflation rate for March will come out and uh, Germany's inflation expected to 1.3% from 1.5% uh, uh, same like in China, so there will be a lowest inflation rate since one year. On Friday, the uh, financial stability report uh, from the Royal Bank of Australia will come out. Um, this will be shown, uh, I think, depends on uh, the numbers of uh, what will come out on Monday regarding the uh, consumer confidence. A little bit later, the balance of trade for China will come out. Uh, the China trade plus uh, was uh, lower to 4.08 billion US dollars in February, the smallest trade plus uh, since the deficit in March 2018. Uh, a number of 10 billion uh, will be expected. In the afternoon, uh, the uh, Michigan consumer sentiment number will come out uh, for April in the United States. And uh, of course, uh, I will expect them also some uh, volatile moves uh, in the currency. So let's see. Thanks for your attention and uh, I hope to see you soon.